we're going to go over rest position and playing position. Um, now, I forgot to mention that Katera did learn rest position the first day. That's another thing you want to teach them in your first lesson. First lesson, you want to learn uh, twinkle rhythms, clapping and saying. You want to learn parts of the instrument and bow. You want to learn how to hold the bow and rest position. Usually those are the things I go over in the first lesson, especially for someone this age. If they're much younger, you may have to only do two of those things. But the clapping is the primary thing. So it just depends on their age and, and the tension span. Okay, so Katera learned how to hold the violin in rest position. So close this door. I have other kids in the house who are practicing, so that's why you hear music. Okay, so this is rest position. The arm goes always behind the tuners, just the way she has it. And the violin scroll points out. Good job. And the bow has a spot for rest position. You make a hook with this finger, and the bow hairs point out, and the hand just hangs down. That's called rest position. And you will notice that Katera, her feet are together. In rest position, the feet are together. All right, so now Katera is going to take a bow. Excellent. <laughs>